been great to see how many fans of Mavs and I still have here and met a bunch of them at the, at the hotel and wherever I went. So it's been it's been fun sharing some uh, some memories with uh, with our Chinese fans. I think everybody knows that about me. Uh, you know, I love it. I, I love interacting with fans. I love, you know, having a connection with them. And every year I'm going to try to take a trip to uh, China because it's been amazing. After Michael Jordan and Yao Ming, basketball has become one of the most popular sports in China. We are here in Shanghai at the NBA Global Game 2018. We can see all the fans from all over China have come here to watch the game and to see their idols. Fans are very excited to have the opportunity to support their favorite teams and favorite players in person and watch an NBA game. I think uh, it's very excited and I think it's just like a big party gathering every NBA fans from all over their China. Other than the NBA care events that are held every time when the teams go to China, this year, a special NBA championship exhibition was held in Shanghai on the day before the game to tell their fans about the 72-year history of the NBA. Due to the geographic uh, limitations, so the Chinese, Chinese fans are, can barely uh, watch the game, can go to the game, and go to the U.S. watch the game. Yeah. So that's why we want to create these uh, exhibition and to have more fans, Chinese fans, could physically experience and with the hope to bring a, like a fresh, innovative, and comprehensive uh, NBA exhibition to them. It's kind of special to see the recognition, uh, to know that uh, there is a uh, NBA exhibition like this. It hasn't always been here. I think it's going to make more people aware of the league and make them fall in love with the league, or like we fall in love with the league. NBA has done such a great job on partnering up, you know, with uh, with China and, and, and educating everybody about the process of basketball. And uh, you're looking at the athletes now. The athletes are starting to play in the NBA. Uh, everybody's really hungry about that opportunity, and uh, it's great for the game. It's great for the world. The attendance of this year's China game was really good. It sold out the day after they opened. Fans turned the nearly one week long China game into a tribute ceremony. They're very excited to have a chance to see their idols. And this year's glory belongs to Dirk Nowitzki. After the game, all the fans shouted MVP, MVP over and over again. This year's China game ended in this very heartwarming scene. This is not just a game. That's why we play and love basketball.